hey y'all what's up y'all could probably tell i'm a little irritated today really irritated at my husband today um just girl my husband getting on my nerve everything's been getting on my nerve um just the littlest stuff has me like really on not on edge but i just i'm i guess on edge yeah i just I, i'm easily irritated and obviously you know i'm pregnant dealing with these pregnancy hormones that has just been girl i'm in the pickup line to get out and i got a few things to do today like oh my god i just been so busy with just trying to move we got what two weeks and some days left what and y'all know when it's like crunch time um trying to move or making a big transition it can just get a little hectic with everything so i'm like finishing up appointments and stuff i got a prenatal appointment i'm about to head to right after i get out um they gotta get the flu shots like i gotta let me tell y'all this raggediness how Irwin army community hospital works on my last nerve and how they make everything so difficult y'all remember them vlogs where i had to go back and forth up to the hospital to drop off paperwork and to pick up paperwork and to wait until something was signed and then go back up there and all of this back and forthness because they just old school for some reason and don't want to fax stuff and don't want to email stuff and don't cloud print or nothing same with this um al finally got his x-rays yesterday uh for his you know lungs are, got an x-ray on his lungs and the children's mercy hospital hospital i can't even talk right but the children's mercy hospital they you know put in orders just to have it cloud printed over to them that means we would just have to go get the x-rays done and everything will be sent to them we ain't got to do nothing in between but erin was saying no we're gonna make it a little difficult for you we don't do cloud printing so we can't send over the images. What we gonna do is hand it to you on an old school CD disc and you gotta walk it into their clinic and hand deliver it to them. Like, just adding another thing on my plate, Lord. I'm like, y'all can't email it, y'all can't fax it. I mean, I guess I know it's different with x-rays because they probably like a different resolution that you can't just put on a picture. You know, I get it. But it's like, God damn. Erwin just be having you walk back and forth. They just must want you to exercise or something. They just must be really big on that. Because they just going to have you coming in and out, in and out, going here, going there. They don't email nothing for you. None of that. So, I <laughs> a whole rant, y'all. There's so much to do. But, yeah, I got to hand deliver that back to the children's clinic. And, um get al squared away with his shots and just try to get them back in daycare for one more day or a couple more days so we can focus on packing that's a whole nother thing because we probably don't have to pack um because we look like we're gonna be doing the military move they're gonna be moving us one last time but you know i want to get them in daycare for a few days just so i can get stuff done and so they can see their teachers one last time because they love the daycare here i love the daycare here i'm gonna be so sad to be leaving this daycare like the teachers there my kids love them like the teachers love my kids so yeah i'm gonna be sad to be leaving there and i want them to go a couple more times before we leave so they can say bye and all of that so yeah just got a lot going on trying to wrap things up last couple weeks here in fort riley so yeah that's what's going on for today y'all gonna hang out with us I, oh i gotta go to the pharmacy too look i'm just remembering stuff i need to write everything down before i forget but i got a lot to do so let's get this shit done <laughs> but this is my 25 week appointment so yeah we coming along six months in my six months of pregnancy getting big al is here he did not have a good day at school teacher said he was not listening every time he go to school like sleepy it's just not a good day uh, he woke up in the middle of the night he had an accident and this child ended up 
sleeping on the floor, on the bathroom floor. I don't know how that happened. He just went in the bathroom and he was sleeping on the floor. <laughs> and when I woke up in the morning, I'm like, what the heck, Al? And his pants was wet right there. I had to get him a bath like super early in the morning. So he didn't get enough sleep. He's sleepy now. And y'all know. Look at him. Look at you. Not listening. I said. Got that little car chat. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, he just needs some sleep. He went to sleep on our way up here, but I had to get him up. I'm like, I am not holding you. Absolutely not. Child, you're going to have to wake up and get to walking. And psh, you should have. But y'all, I love this ponytail. But it's about to fall off. I was readjusting it. Um, while I was waiting for Alan to pick up mine, I had took this ponytail off and tried to like put it back in because it was kind of hurting in the back. And I put it back on, but it's like loose and I feel like it's about to slide off. Pray for my ponytail. My damn ponytail that came out, Lord. Oh, let me hurry up for the doctor to come back in. What? I could have recorded that. Al, he was listening to baby sister Harvey. The doctor, she was so cool. She let him, uh, yep, we're going down there. We gotta catch an elevator. She let him uh, do the thing and she let him put the bed up and down. He was Dr. Al up in there. You was Dr. Al? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Did you help the doctor? And you got to listen to baby sister's heartbeat? Yeah. Yup. And you put the thing on my belly? Yeah. Yep. Did you like that? Yep. <laughs> Y'all, I'm so geeked about Apple Pay because I literally I just it. learned I how to do it. <laughs> I and I, I just love it so much. Uh, now nah, I'm gonna get something else. What should I get? You get, uh, I don't know. Hmm, I want some candy too. I think I'm gonna get Skittles. You want Skittles? Yeah. What's the like how cool is that? Oh, what's the <laughs> huh? Yeah, I'm getting Skittles. Oh, it better come out because it looks like it's kind of far back. Okay, All right, got my Skittles. There we go. There you go. There you go. Thank you. Y'all, yeah, this point is working on my nerves. I know y'all have seen it slide out, and it is still. Like loose, so I gotta do it over again. But I was trying to rush and put it back on before the doctor came in there, and it is just oh my god! I started off the day so cute, like finally said I was gonna get cute, at least decent. Oh. Filmed a uh, bump day today because I've been walking around feeling busted, looking busted. And today I'm gonna get a little bit of cute. My ponytail don't act right. Okay, I think I got it in now. That, there we go. I can shake with this one. But yeah, this is my first time seeing 
this doctor, like I said, she was cool. She let Al, you know, participate. That was so cute. I wish I could have recorded that, but you know. Um, I liked her and everything. It's my first time seeing her. Cause you know, when you at a hospital, you see like different providers or try to stick with the same one. Like, no, nah, if she ain't available on that day, give me the other day. <laughs> Cause I got a particular doctor that I like here. But you know, it was like a last minute appointment. I took what I could get considering, you know, we move into. Okay, get it out. He be getting back into his little beatboxing, <laughs> hiding behind me. I made him nervous. But, um, but yeah, it was my first time seeing her. I liked her and everything. She just said something that was like, mm, she was kind of like discouraging about home births. And I was just like, okay. We're gonna talk about that later <laughs> with my birth and plans and things like that. My, my ponytail got your eye. Uh oh. <laughs> my bad. Al, stop grabbing on it. Super long. I love this ponytail. See baby sister up in here. It's your baby sister getting big. <laughs> 25 weeks, what's up? I had a good 25 week prenatal appointment. That was my last appointment. Yes, girl. My last appointment up here at this hospital. I have one more prenatal appointment at the um, maternal medicine place where I'll get my you know, ultrasound, making sure that baby girl kidneys is coming along as they are. I'm gonna take my glucose test early at this hospital. Um, so instead of 28 weeks, I'm going in at 26 weeks, which will be next week. So stay tuned for that. And that whole crazy, y'all know the diabetes test where you gotta drink the drink and be chilling up at the hospital for a whole hour. And I think the next one is three hours. It's something like that. So I gotta do that next week. And after that, I'll get all my medical records and be out that beat. I never go there again. <laughs> Your friend have that? What is that? Who is that? Super Mario? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Mama, my my friend has Super Mario. He had that at uh, JJ at his birthday party? No. No? Who? No, my friend has Super Mario. Oh, he had Super Mario at school? Really? It's a Mario Oh, he has a Mario backpack. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> but I got our bag of meds, <laughs> Al's asthma stuff, um, more abuterol. What's that? A game? Yeah, I'm stopping and looking at everything like he ain't been here a million times. <laughs> but um, got his abuterol for his nebulizer, the inhalers. Um, Singular, that's what it's called, the chewable tablet he'll take every day to help control his asthma. And I'm glad he doesn't have like real bad asthma. They diagnosed it as, con uh, damn, I'm forgetting what they said. I think it was called like controlled asthma Mama, or like mild. Race cars. Race cars. Don't touch them. All right, got all our stuff. I got Popeyes. I ended up buying Al and Isaac a little race car. I wasn't supposed to be buying them no more toys. Right now, yep, you got a red one and Isaac got a blue one. Anyway, we about to head home. It's been a day. I'm not gonna say it's been a long day because it really haven't. I've been in the house for the most part. Mama, let's go to this. Let's go to daddy's my race car and my pink one. You want to go show daddy your race car and your pink one? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> well, let's go. I want to go show off his new. Oh, excuse me, little toys. And that was the first time they ever gave us toys at Popeyes with the kids' meal. So that was nice. Popeyes. Got a little toy. Popeyes, yeah. <laughs> so I want to go show off his race car. It is chicken at Popeyes, yep. So I've been craving some chicken wings for a little minute now. I was going to cook my own, but it is 5.37. I do not even feel like going to the grocery store to pick up no wings. And then I damn sure don't feel like cooking no wings. So just went to Popeyes, got some food. Got our little stuff. I still didn't get to do everything I needed to do, like drop off that stupid disc. <laughs> it's not stupid, that's my baby lungs on there. But y'all know, the, the situation is stupid. So I'm gonna have to just do it another day. I'm hungry, 
hopefully this medicine i got new medicine but i got the same medicine but they upped my dosage so it'll be stronger so i'm about to take that like right now i ain't got oh i got some mm, pop right here i'm about to take my medicine because i'm supposed to take it 30 minutes before i eat so oh i'm crossing my fingers that this medicine do me right and just don't have me just acting a fool don't have this reflex acting a fool lord jesus Whew, let's all touch and agree on this here medicine that it works and it does what it's supposed to do so i can eat all of this chicken because i want this chicken so bad i don't want to feel sick afterwards thank you lord that's all i ask this race car is so cool these really not like kid cars they're collectibles but this one is so cool but this one is so cool because it's a piggy bank car bank or whatever hold on let me show let me show the vlog what your car can do so yeah he could put money in here start saving his little money open the um hood <laughs> the hood opens and the trunk opens y'all yeah, got the cool one so these are so cute they so heavy you know they collect the boots or whatever race. you want to race one two three one, two, go, three, go. <laughs> <laughs> you won! Isaac over here, knocked out. Trying to wake him up. He is not budging. Do this. Mama, I see, I see Little God lips. Do see lips. I see God. <laughs> Uh-oh. He fell asleep eating some crackers. It was so cute. Oh, boy. I came up here. He had a half-eaten cracker in his head. So cute. Eating your crackles. And then you just fell asleep. He like, when Isaac is asleep, he sleep. Like, he don't play about his sleep. Isaac, that race <laughs> car you like. Look, I want you to wake up. He trying to show you your new race car. I said race car you like. <laughs> and he is not. Look at him. Feet hanging. Ponytail is snatched. Okay. That means I'm ready to go to bed. Yeah. I'm tired. I'm about to um, attempt to eat. I took my medicine. I really don't feel like it's doing that. And I still feel like, mm, like tight. I'll just eat one wing. Add a little bit of fries and see how that is working with me because the reflux is worse at like at night with my dinner. So I'm just gonna eat just just a little bit and um, hopefully the medicine. Well, let me eat this little bit and not feel horrible tonight. So, yeah, that's the end of this vlog. Like I said, I'm tired. I'm ready to go to sleep. Watch this makeup off my face, y'all. I never showed y'all my nails, but look at these. These have been on for like over two weeks, and guess what? They press on. Yes. These are press on, and they've been holding on like what like i get co so many compliments on my nails and i'm like every time i tell them they press on they like what yes girl so press on is gonna be my new thing when i just don't feel like doing my nails or when i you know i just want something quick because they last okay it looked like actual acrylic or something like it looked like i need like a little bit of a feeling but they still like look good they still holding on they ain't popping off nothing that's it for today's vlog thank y'all so much for hanging out i will catch y'all in the next one